That's being in the spirit. That's being united for that one cause. We in this truth, man. You know. Now, when Yahweh Shai and the angels came to see Abraham, uh, Abraham said, "What?" I mean, said, "Come in and have a seat mm -hmm. uh, 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 and relax." Mm -hmm. He pr he pressured him, right? He pressured yep. him. Yep. And he and he had his had one of his uh, servants to cook for him. Yeah. yeah. So, so he was being hospitable, hospitable. Mm. and he had faith, man. Because the apostles always tell us, they say back in the ancient world, if a guest at your house, that was considered more valuable than anything. Nothing could happen to that guest. Right. That's why if you see the story of uh, Lot, yeah. Lot gave up his daughters. Mm -hmm. Lot could have known they were angels or couldn't have known, but he yeah. knew they were Israelites. Yeah. He was going yeah. to give up his daughters exactly. so another man wouldn't commit an abomination. So that show, he said, look, I'm finna value these men I just met today yeah. because they're in my house. I'm yeah. finna value them to my daughters I've known since they was, because they had to be at least 12 because they were virgins. Yeah. So they had to be 12 and up. We're going to go from there. We don't use scoffers and, you know, scorners out there. We're going to go to up. Let's say they were in their 19s, 20s, because they pop them at these yeah. ages that out here. Yeah. So they were in the, the 18, young tenderoni. Yeah. He was willing to risk two of his daughters. Uh -huh. Not one. He said, I'll give you one. He right. said, two of them yeah. for these strangers, man. Mm -hmm. Oh, now when the Benjamites was, uh, is in the I was just the thinking, I was just thinking that too. Right. Now, uh, now the, the guy's uh, servant, mm -hmm. or his guest, his aunt, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I made his house. The, the bitchin' mice was basically he's trying to rape him, basically. All right, man. But he gave, I think his concubine? His concubine. All right, man. He gave his concubine uh, to those wicked Benjamites. All right, man. Now, so he, he had that much faith uh, to give his concubine to some wicked men, man. Yep. All right, man. So, just so his, his, his guest... I would be safe, man. Yeah, he was guesting at the house. Uh, yeah, but yeah. he gave, he gave, yeah. he gave it, uh, gave it out to, to say, look, man, mm -hmm. that was a vile act. That's why Benjamin got dealt with like that. Yeah. But on the on the point where we, we where we're trying to bring through is say, look, guests were highly valuable in those days. Just mm -hmm. like right now, that's why it says you would you would you would give a lot for a, a person that guessed at your house and lodged at your house, man. They were highly valued, man. Mm -hmm. Read on. Kind of says, speak. No, it says to speak evil of no man, to be no brawlers, mm -hmm. but gentle, mm -hmm. showing all meekness mm -hmm. unto all men. He said all men, and those are le uh, men, uh, leg men too. Now we can show that hospitality to a Hamite or a Japhite, or you know, basically the two third. But this right here, hey, this is this is us you know what i'm saying this is the brotherhood go ahead and it says for ourselves it says for we ourselves also were sometimes foolish we sometimes foolish we didn't understand what was Damn. going on we was unwise mm -hmm. you it's know a banger you know it says for we ourselves were sometimes foolish mm -hmm. disobedient not compliant and adhere to these uh uh, uh law statutes commandments man we we was we was two-thirds at one time man you know Lord willing, we the men that make it. Because right. the men that make it, the spirits, when it's come back, you always going to be the elect, but you just, you wicked. And you got to, that one day, yeah. that spirit out, like it's like the spirit out, the wind out, blowing your face, and then you be all right. What's mm -hmm. that? I, I stir up your pure minds, right. though you yeah, once knew this. Yep. Yeah. And Jude, yeah. you know, go ahead. And it says, for we ourselves were also sometimes foolish. Disobedient, deceived, you strayed away, man. Mm. We were in the Islam, we was in the uh, uh, Scientology, Egyptology, we was in the, all that, man. Mm -hmm. And you don't, you don't really, and, and you don't really show brotherly love in, in those uh, 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 other philosophies, man. Right. Because I myself used to be in Islam, man, and I and I, I I went from this side of the world to the other side of the world, just saying, look, if I can go over there and they ought to take me in. But it's not like that, man. No. They look at you like, hey, you know, you're not their brother, man. They'll set you up. So they ain't brotherly love, man. You know? 
For we ourselves were also sometimes foolish, disobedient, deceived, mm -hmm. serving diverse lusts. Just serving our own desires, man. Mm -hmm. Just to be wicked. Whatever that desire was. You know? You know, it was all wicked, man. Go ahead. Serving diverse lusts and pleasures, living in malice. Ill will, man. That's how we were. Yeah. You know? And when you like that, it's, you're not going to be brotherly, man. Trust me. Because you ain't trusting. You had an attitude when you're in the world. I don't trust no damn body. Mm -hmm. You know? Then somebody share a blunt with you two or three times. They got that fire. You open up. That's how they take them dudes. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. my dude right Oh, that's here. my guy right there, bro. Man, that shit's stupid, man. He done match you on two or three, so he's, he's the... <laughs> Man, that shit crazy, man. And it says, uh, disobedient, deceived, serving diverse lusts and pleasures, mm -hmm. living in malice and envy. Envy, man. It's real hard down spike. Mm -hmm. Man, that envy, that envy is so cold. Being jealous is one thing, being envious is yeah, another. Because yeah, yeah. envy, you, 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 you'll, you'll kill. hurt a person. You'll, you'll kill. kill. You'll shit. kill. You'll kill. You That's know? why it says, uh, it's, I think it's in Psalms. The envy of man will will lead to that. I'm paraphrasing, but that's that's the, the times that we in. And that's how Esau is. He since since Cain and since Esau, he's envied us being the children of the Lord to the point where he's killed us. He's killed us. And Continue he's still, to kill, kill us. Still kill he us. won't stop. Psalms 83. Man, it's crazy. He won't stop, man. How long? He envy us, man. Hey, that's a sit down. Esau is envious. Yeah. He envious. Like the brother just said, man, he is. That's why Esau, he'll pay, he'll pay, uh, um, I always deal you, even with college ball, because I, I went to a, a Mizzou, little Mizzou game, they'll pay thousands of dollars to get a box seat or a little area yeah. or tickets to watch Jake, man. Mm -hmm. That's beyond, oh, I, oh, let me just go and watch these. No, you, you want to you will pay money to sit yeah. there and watch something you could never be, man. Yeah. You can never do it. You can never jump like Jake, run like Jake, look like Jake, act like Jake, right, fight like dance, Jesus. fight like. I mean, there's the list goes on yeah. and on. Even Edomites will say it. They'll be like, man, them black dudes, man, they pack it. Yeah. Or, or, or man, them black people can dance. They'll they, they'll say it. A yeah. racist dude will tell you something that you do that he can't. Right. As racist as he is, he'll still give you that. Yeah, he would. He yeah. said, I don't care how bad you can dance, you're still a nigga. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but he'll give you a prop though. But that's that's all I wanted to add it. Mm. And, and it says, for ourselves, we're sometimes foolish, disobedient, deceived, serving diverse lusts and pleasures, living in malice and mm -hmm. envy, mm -hmm. hate. Full and hating one another. And testing the next man. Hey, you're not gonna get that with, with, with this brotherhood, man. Brothers, hey, you know, well you gonna get it, some brothers gonna be tough. Yeah, but for the most part, man, brothers is when you when you living according to the scriptures, man, you're gonna be brotherly, man. You know? You ain't gonna look at no brother no ill way or think he's something that he's not. Or, you know, you're going you to be on point, man. And it says, but after that, the kindness and love of Yahweh, our Savior, fondness. towards... He had fondness in his heart. Man. So why can't the brother, you got to have that fond, meek, humble spirit. You know? Go ahead. It says, but after that, the kindness and love of Yahweh, our Savior, towards man appeared. Mm. Damn. That's 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 a hey, when you say fondness, and this is a power. Mm. This is not a regular old Joe. Clearly made it known, man. He clearly made it known. He came back, you know, and the way the way he lived his life, man. Cause what did he do? He dealt with Jake. Yeah. He dealt with Israel. Cause he told what the woman at the well, what am I to give the meat for the for the children and give it unto dogs? Right. Everything was in order. Every everything was in order to set to give everything had to be given to to Jake it was it was set in order he didn't go out of and this had powers to go off the off the rail mm -hmm. but it was followed to go down to them mm -hmm. to go down to them he taught them what forgive you know before Yahweh shy that malice was heavy man mm -hmm. the, because he taught to for what to to forgive to love and to bring what is the greatest among these love man mm -hmm. So love wasn't a, a lot of options to Jake before yeah, that. He right. really showed it because he had the spirit, spiritual power to just destroy you. 
Damn. So he he really showed it, man. He's like he is the embodiment of what we should be, man, and how we should con conduct ourselves and, and walk accordingly, man. So hey, man, you need, man, that's 